it's what we do this for all year long. So many details that I think a lot of people probably wouldn't realize. All the things that need to happen on the course and the warehouse. It's really rewarding to see it all come together and, and be successful. On your marks. I've done this race three times now and a lot of twists and turns, hills that sneak up on you. But today I was like, oh, I'm feeling good. And then I, I happened to have an extra kick at the end and finish strong. <laughs> It's so much fun. You know, we have the best team of people that help us. Uh, we also have the support of the base and community volunteers and people that come out and do it. So it, it does make it less overwhelming. It started as a celebration of the Air Force's birthday. I and mean, it's a way to bring together not just the Dayton community, but really Air Force members, Air Force veterans, uh, people who have affiliation, people who don't have affiliation, uh, but they just want to come out here and, and support us and support uh, Wright-Patterson Air Force Base. Feeling really good, the experience was great. Over 1,200 people got up really early in the morning to make sure the course was ready to go, to make sure the start line, the finish line was great. I'm really inspired, and we're just really excited to have all that support. I was running along, and then all of a sudden, there was this bike next to me, and I said, why are you following me? And he said, I have to follow the first play female, and I was like, Wow, I guess that's me. <laughs> it's cool that the first race I won was the Air Force Marathon, so I guess it was good support and lots of cheerleaders. Thanks for cheering us on.